Okay, good morning, everybody. Happy Saturday. <laughs> it's Saturday. And today is Super Saturday. Hope you guys are up and at it. Moving your body. And we got a plan for today. We don't plan on just, you know, sitting around lounging all day. So, get up if you're not up and make a plan. Get out there, do some exercise. Get that water in, stay hydrated, eat right. If you haven't started working on yourself, let's start today, okay? Today is Saturday and it's a new day. If you fell off the wagon, you can start again today. So, I'm going to do my arm exercise. Okay, let me take this off and we're going to start working out on the arm exercise. I have my weights on. Okay, I got the weights, my ankle weights. So let's see, what are we going to start working out with? I'm going to do something because I had been doing the, um, the fitness hoop and I'm going to do that twice a day. Anyway, by myself, I did it. And when you do the fitness hoop, you have to do it on the right side because that video is only for 15 minutes. And remember, when you're hooping, you have to do both sides. And when I come on, I only do the, the right side. But later on in the evening, I do the left. And that's just too long, you know what I'm saying? So remember, when you do the right side, you got to go back and you got to do the left side. It doesn't matter. If you hoop for 15 minutes, you got to do half on the right, half on the left. Okay, so let me see what we're going to do. We'll do the 10 minute. Let me see which one. Okay, let me put this fan off. We're going to do the, um, the four minute, no arm. Oh, I did do that one before, how to get toned arms. Okay, with that one, you have to go all down on the ground and stuff. So we'll just start with the four minute arm toning this morning, but you want to start with something. You want to um, work your whole entire body. Okay, so we're gonna start out doing the four minute arm toning. So get ready, and that's also on the page, or you can go over on YouTube and pull it up. It is called the four minute no weight arm toning workout, and it's with pop sugar. Okay, so let me get on over to that. I had to um, make it quick, you know what I'm saying? That's one of my favorite um, songs that I hoop with. The Hula Hula Hoop song. <laughs> I love that song. You know, when you have some good music and you're hooping and stuff, you tend to hoop longer. But when you're on, when you're on Facebook, you have to have the royalty-free music or you have to have the exercise music that you hoop to. And I'm telling you, when you take the hoop out, and you're outside, you know, when it's nice outside and it's not too hot, or you go to the park, um, I'm telling you, it, can, it is like so much fun. Or if it's just nice outside, period. You don't even have to go to the park. Put, put yourself on some good music and exercise. You know, hooping is good for your core, your cardio, and you can also, out to the side. We're gonna rotate them forward and back. if you have the weighted hoop, Hold on. it's good for the whole entire body. And let me turn this off. And let's get started. Make sure before any exercise that you stretch and get your physicals done with your doctors. If you haven't, make those appointments. I keep telling you because that's really important. You've got to get yourself checked out to make sure you're okay. Make sure you don't have any internal bleeding or anything like that. Um, blood work, x-rays, okay? The full, complete physical. And that's eyes, okay? And also oral hygiene. Make sure you get on top of your teeth and stuff. 
you know, if you have body odor, anything, ladies, see your OBGYN, you know, and guys, get your um, prostate and everything else checked. And that's also mammograms, breast checks and stuff with men too. So let's go ahead and get started this morning and stay hydrated. Take those arms out to the side. We're going to rotate them forward and back. Hold on to those core muscles. I want you to feel nice and centered. And later I have to come yeah. back and I'm going to tell you about some of the new products. Yeah. And our mango <laughs> that I put on the page. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's selling out fast. Great tone in the arms. See, you don't always need the weight. You can just use all your strength to take it forward and back, toning up the arms. That's it. Flex the palm of the hand. Little circles back. Suck your stomach in. That's it. And take it forward. Woo! Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> See, little great movements, fun. they get to be burning. Oh, those little movements, that's what it's all about. Okay, we're going to do double arms up and down. And up and down. And as always, smile through it. Feel good. <laughs> up and down. Music makes everything better, that's right? So much better. Oh, yeah. And we're going to take it forward now. So double. Guess what I have? Back. The rumble rush. Really flex the palm of the hands, it just fires up all Notice those muscles in the arms. That's it. Four more. And the daily yeah. hemp oils and, and blends. And two. The Last one. Really gets it too. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Hold it out. Now bring the arms in and out. Bring it in and Ooh. out. Such clarity. That's it. And so focus. we're really extending those fingertips to the side. You want to really elongate those arms. Keep them at shoulder height. Keep it nice and relaxed in the shoulders. Hold in the core. Woo! And now let's speed it up. Here we go. Out and in. That's it. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Four more. Four. And three. So you got to get rid of these back Two. Tighten them all Now up. we're going to take the arms in. Now we're going to close it in and out. So you want to open out the chest. Shoulders, as always, nice and relaxed. Push those shoulder blades down the back of the body. That's it. Really resist those elbows from touching. Now let's speed it up. In and out. Woo. Oh, it's like we're in a, in a private like dance party. for the arms here. Woo. I love it. Oh, yeah, it's about having fun, but of course, toning up as well. Now we're going to take the arms up and down. So slow it down and bring it down. Up and okay. down. So you want to really use those elbows to drive the arms down. That's it. Now let's speed it up as always. Push it up, down. So it's like a stretch, but also like a toning section for the arms. This yeah. wants some nice, gorgeous arms. Push it up. I'm going to remember this routine. <laughs> Four, <laughs> three, two. two. Now we're going to lean the body forward a touch. Push those arms to the back by your side. Push the palms away from the body. That's it. Excellent. Ooh. Oh yeah, back of the arms. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All about the backs of those arms. <laughs> yeah. Push Come it up. Now. Or you can modify. So you can modify this one. We don't have to stand go up far like this. forward. So Triana can come up a little bit taller. Not this high, but like this. Yeah. And the right like this. Get a good burn with this. Oh yeah, yeah. still a good burn. Six. Five, four, three, turn the palms together. Now we're going to squeeze those arms together. Yes. Feel those shoulder blades. You can feel it too burning. And you're going to breathe as always. Push it in. Eight, seven, seven six, five, five, four, three, two, two, and one. Relax. Let's roll those shoulders. Oh, roll those shoulders. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's it. And forward. Okay, so that's the end of that one. Okay, let's go back and see what we have. And I think maybe, let's see if we can put some of the, I don't know, should we do the, that one exercise was real. I think I might just do that, um, yeah, this workout. This arm workout is really good too. There's been an assassination Let's attempt on the president. The president's top guardian angel has fallen. Can't you see I'm being set up? I'm trying to stop it till I prove who really did this. Let me get my weights one second.
Hey guys, it's Tiffany and welcome to my full body workout series. Today we're going to work on our arms, getting them nice and strong and lean and long. So I'm going to use a pair of hand weights. If you don't have hand weights, you are more than welcome to use a couple cans of soup out of your pantry or just follow along with absolutely nothing and you will still feel the burn and get a nice workout from this video. So to start off, we are gonna just do some basic bicep curls. So you're gonna start at about 90 degrees. And you're gonna come up nice and slow. Maybe I should use the bigger ones. That's what I was thinking about using the bigger ones. To get the best. Oh, you know what else? Oh, one of the ladies, I'm gonna show you. Um, instead of using the weights, if you don't have weights, let me show you what else you can use. one of the ladies was saying she didn't have any weights. If you don't have weights, you can also use water bottles and you can also use cans or you don't have to use anything at all, okay? So let's get started. Hey guys, it's Tiffany and welcome to my full body workout series. Today we're going to work on our arms, getting them nice and strong and Is lean and long. Light, so light work, I'm um, going to use a pair of hand weights. If you don't have hand weights, you are more than welcome to use a couple cans of soup out of your pantry or just follow along with absolutely nothing and you will still feel the burn and get a nice workout sure from this will. video. So to start off, we are going to just do some basic bicep curls. So you're going to start at about 90 degrees. And you're going to come up nice and slow and go down nice and slow. Let's you want to keep it nice down. and controlled to get the best yeah, you feeling feel it more when out you of your workout. Get the best results. When you have weights, you feel it more. Your arms are going to be nice and tired. We're going to try to go non-stop to get the best, best workout out of your time. But if you get too tired or if it becomes too much, you are perfectly fine to take a, a break. Okay. All right. So now we're going to go from here. We're going to put our hands at our side and we're gonna do the lateral dumbbell raise. So you're gonna just lift up. You don't wanna go up too high because that's bad on your shoulders. So you wanna stay Step right here in. and then bring it back down. Again, nice okay. controlled movements. If you just sit there, go really fast and sloppy, it's not gonna Take do your time. you as good as if you keep your movements you controlled really and slow. How we're gonna get toned arms. It's gonna burn. Just work through it. Okay, guys. Great job. So, I wanna know what is your trouble spot? If you'll just leave me a comment. I want to know what it is that bothers you, what you most want to work on and make better. What's your trouble spot? I surely can tell you my trouble spot. Okay, guys, so now we're going to do the tricep kickback. Just want to. You're going to start off with your dumbbells in front of you. You're going to do and the tricep kickback. You're going to just back, bend, over, bend slightly over slightly, keep your back straight. And back straight and bend your knees. in front. And you're just gonna go back. This is gonna work out your tricep muscles you so that we can arms, get your arms elbows, a good like workout the side, all the way around. And then go back. We want all of those muscles to be toned, all of those muscles to be engaged to give you your dream arms. So, the purpose of my full body workout series is that you have a variety of 10 minute videos. So if you are in a hurry and only have 10 minutes to work out, you can pick the workout that is most appropriate for you for the day. Or if you have more time 
and you are wanting to focus on specific body parts, you can mix and match. Pick the videos that you want to work on, the body parts you want to focus on, and then you don't have to worry about extra stuff. You can go straight to the workout, straight to the body part, and then go on with your workout. Build them as you need them, what you want to do. Get the workout in that you're, you're focused on. Okay, guys. So shake it out. And we're gonna go Shake right back in to doing bicep curls. The goal is to try and do as much as possible without stopping. It's only 10 minutes, and we want to make every move minute move continuously count. without stopping. Nice, controlled. Feel the burn. If you have to take a break, that's perfectly fine. Just take a break, let your arms reset, and then jump right back in whenever you're ready. Okay, guys. So okay, we're just gonna push. Now we're ready for another up. move. Go all the way up and then come back down to 90 degrees. Up and down gonna work out your shoulder muscles again we're trying to work every angle of our arms all right and just for fun I'll let y'all see what this looks like from the back so you want to have 90 degree arms and push them up down and up down up Feel the burn. That burn is your friend. That's how you know that it's working and you're getting results. Please do me a favor and share this out. It might help somebody in. Help someone get up and start moving their body. Two more. I truly appreciate One, it. Two. A lot of us don't have anybody to work out with or we just Now need a we're gonna do anterior okay. dumbbell raises. So we're gonna raise our arms just up straight. Again, don't go up too high. Make sure you go parallel with the ground and then back down. These are great exercises. You're gonna feel the burn. This is gonna work your anterior deltoids. Don't go too fast. So it'll give you nice toned shoulders all the way down into your arms. Okay, three more. One, two, three. Okay, so we're gonna do the tricep kickback again. So okay. you wanna have your feet hip width apart. Bend. bend your knees slightly, bend, bend slightly over a little bit. Back straight. And you're gonna have dumbbells out in front of you. And you're just gonna kick it back. Feel it in your thighs. Go back as far as you can. Don't make yourself uncomfortable. Just put your arms back as much as you can. You want to work out your arms, not injure them. So if it's painful for you, don't overdo it. Don't push yourself. Just do what best works for you. Okay, we're gonna do five more. Five, five four, four, three, two, two one. Okay. Shake it out. Okay, so now we're just gonna stretch our arms out a little bit, give you a little bit of a cool down. So you'll just reach your arm out in front and use your other arm to just kind of pull it across. Look that was. Stretch them out so that they get a nice break. After all that hard work, you did great. You made it through and you are a step closer 
to reaching your goals. Shake it out. Awesome job, guys. Y'all did wonderful today. Thank you so much See for joining that me. Please make sure to favorite this video so you can okay. consistent. We're just moving right along today. What little workout? Moving right along. Okay. Let's see what we have left. Alrighty. This is just wonderful. Okay. And remember, I will be back here later um, to go over all the products. And the mango is selling out quickly, okay? 70% of the mango, I put the thing up yesterday, has been sold. And remember, the, um, the mango in the canister, if you read, is only 15 servings. And the normal canister, or the regular canister of zeal that we have, is 30 servings. So the mango is only 15 servings. So let me know if you're interested. I'm just letting you guys know, you know, it's going, 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 it'll be gone. So, better get them orders in. Let me know. And I'll let you know exactly what you need to do. Okay, let me see. We're going to do the 15 minute. Actually, we're not going to, I'm not going to hoop this, um, Based on the best-selling novel, I just want to um, get a little bit of hooping in, okay? Call it luck. And All I knew was I would... Why did we have this um, infomercial just playing, okay? Okay, let's get up, do our hooping, suck in that stomach. This is your 15 Make sure you breathe. Countdown. Your workout okay. in four, three... Two, one. Remember, find something that you enjoy. Find something that you like. And I'm telling you that um, that exercise, that fitness exercise I was doing yesterday with the hoop. You need to try that one instead of standing in place all the time. And just, you know, pump in the hoop. There are so many different workouts that you can do with your hoop. And a lot of times, you know, I just get on here and do the hooping and you guys don't see the fitness workout. That's why I've been showing you this new one that I've tried. But I can do a lot of them. And all you got to do is go right over on YouTube. And it helps strengthen up your, your whole body, you know. If you're not coordinated, it will help you. And when you do the fitness workout, you're not just, you know, just standing here, you know, twirling the hoop and stuff around. Even though this is not easy, okay, especially when you have a weighted hoop. And when you learn, you have to suck in that stomach, okay? And what they recommend is starting out, you know, when you first start out doing three minutes and every day adding a minute to it. And personally, me, you know, the daily recommended amount for exercise is 30 minutes. I like to do 30 to 45 minutes. Some people do it an hour, you know, it's up to you. But they say 10 minutes a day should be, you know, enough. But like I say, um, my school, so I can get certified. It starts, I'm not sure if it's at the end of this month, you know, that's my plan. I'm gonna be doing classes and stuff. And when you do classes, you wanna make sure you have your stuff down packed. You don't wanna just get in there and just teach the people just how to work a hoop and that's it. You want them to be able to work their whole entire body. So you wanna have other exercises and stuff that they can do, you know, because anybody can, learn how to twirl a hoop, but you want to, you know, you want them to be effective at what they're doing, and also have fun with that. You can have fun, and you can also have a great workout at the same time. And, you know, a lot of people like to dance hooping too, that's great exercise too. A lot of people don't like the big weighted hoops, some people like the, you know, the smaller hoops. 
But whatever you do, you want it to be fun. Three minutes gone. When you pump your, I'm telling you, pump, it makes the hoop go faster. Remember, you got to do both sides. Close, twist, and turn on. Where do you die? So, when you hoop, try to have some comfortable clothes on. The clothes will be all twisted and everything else. You see a lot of people just have their little, sh their little shirts that tuck in and stuff. Is this hoop? Have it snagged all around. Your clothes be snagged around. See, today I have the weights on my ankles. Four gone. This is the eight pound hoop today. So. Get out, get yourself a walk in, okay? If you don't feel like exercising, walk. Or you can also sit in a chair and do some exercises to start something. And you can also use weights and stuff. There was, you know, the exercise I was doing yesterday. There's so many different things you can do with your arms. Also have kettlebells. The weights, you know. The only thing is that um, the bigger, I'm talking about size, the weight of the hoop, okay, the harder it makes when you're doing those fitness workouts, you know. You can be really strong, strong, strong. I personally, I say, you know, so you can be very effective at, at your workout. I say five pounds, no more than six. You know, but then again, because even sometimes this hoop right here, you know, you're working and working and working so much, feels so light. You know, then we have the other people that have gone up, you know, their size 10 hoops and this, that, whatever. But, you know, that's up to you. But it doesn't matter. As long as you're moving those muscles, whether it's one, two, three pounds, as long as you're moving those muscles. Okay? That's what counts. Start out working out in the morning time and burn more calories and when you exercise on an empty stomach too, okay? But if you're in poor health, make sure you eat yourself some food first. If you eat a small meal, you need to wait about 40 minutes. If you have a nice big breakfast, you need to wait about three or four hours before you work out. That's if you're in poor health, okay? And whatever you do, start not in the morning, it stays with you. So make sure you get that water and stuff in. Water flushes your kidneys, okay? It's good for your skin, keeps you hydrated, okay? For your brain. And you have more clarity. When you get up in the morning time and you work out, okay? You think better, you feel better throughout the day. Instead of walking around feeling all sluggish all day. Hey, good morning. You know? You gotta start putting yourself first. You gotta start showing up for yourself. <laughs> Tony, how you doing, honey? <laughs> Trying to get the exercise in, girl. We have Super Saturday today. I have to go out to the gym and show off stuff. Plus, I got to do my stuff on the page today. Show all the products. How you doing, honey? You've already gotten your workout in. What program, exercise programs? You work out with Tony. That's what I said. If anybody has any ideas or any new exercises you want to share, put it on the page. Okay. Because right at the top, you know, at Denise Michelle's Health and Wellness, there's exercises at the top. But if you have something new, hey, let me know. 
It's always good to switch up and do new things, you know. <laughs> I see you had yourself a little good time last night, Tony. <laughs> people. That is my time. I got to get my stuff set up oh, for the Super Saturday. And I'll be back here in a little bit to go over all of the products and stuff. I always try to pick Saturday because, you know, a lot of people are home. Oh, okay. Oh, yes. Please do, because you know what, me and my um, daughter was talking about that. We wanted to find a good class, and also we found some um, equipment. We were over at the, um, I forgot what store we were in, and they had this little rod that you could do um, Pilates with. But um, I'll be back later. Excuse me, I can even do it out. I'll be back a little later. Let me put this off. Six minutes to go. I will be back here probably about let me see what time it is because i've got to do the super saturday i got to be there at one so i'll probably come back in about um maybe an hour or so and go over all the products i don't know what is up with this um tv today i'm on youtube oh boy but um <coughs> in any case i don't know what is wrong with this thing I just want to remind everybody to get up, move, get your water in, okay? Make a plan for yourself and start showing up for yourself, okay? Nobody can take care of you better than you can, so you have to be your best advocate you can be for your own self. Thank you for joining me. Please share this out, and you guys have a great day. Take care. Thank you for the replay viewers.